watch out Melbourne, cause you have a new bad boy. In town. And his name is Martin Hanna. I've been a bad boy. <laughs> you change your channel at the side of his face, but he brought the control, stupid. The stupid music. <laughs> and don't forget the canned laughter. In, who is this guy? And what am I even doing here? Coming to Fox, never. Tula, let's go cruising in Shiki and I fully stick in there. Watch this. Watch it, watch me. or something like that? Sorry, you're trying to start me. That's all. Nah, bro. Oi, oi, oi. So, you, like, you guys run this joint, yeah? Can you, like, guys, like, uh, get some flippers? Can you get some flippers, bro? He means goggle that. Goggle <laughs> <laughs> what? Goggle <laughs> that. Yeah, here you go. Oh, yeah, let's Oh, yeah. oh, oh yeah. so poppy. Thank you. It's all right. You're mad, bro. Oh my god! Woo! I'm raging, man! Let's go! Fuck that! Man, they don't cheeks in this place, bro! Oh, all the cheeks, man! Oh, he's a fucking horror skills! Ooh, let's go hunt together, huh? Let's go! Yeah, baby! It's a beautiful morning! Anyway, baby, that was the last time I got laid, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. Anyway, fuck okay. What are you doing next week? Fuck! What? Hey, hey, sorry! Sorry about him, man. He's a true man. What the fuck just happened, man? What are you talking about, man? Man, this fucking goggle lots, whatever the fuck that was. Uh uh, man. Uh, one of those c were laughing at us. What the fuck happened last time? Man, we had a good night, didn't we? Yeah. <laughs> Man, I feel, man, I think I got probed or something, man. Fucking But you got probed, not me, man. <laughs> <laughs> I was doing the probing. <laughs> You're, You're fucked. fucked. You're fucked. Man, what the fuck? fuck? I'm getting the fuck out of here. I need to stop. I'm getting the fuck out of here. Well, Sorry, girls, I've got to go, alright? I'll see you around. What the fuck are you doing? You're blowing a good thing. No, what the hell I was thinking? I'll fix your car and you'll get it back in one piece, don't you worry. We'll take good care of you. I'm Dale. Let me fix your car. I'll take good care of your car. We'll fix your car. Real cheap. My name's Dale. I'll fix your car. We'll take good care of you. We're always gonna take care of your car. I'll fix your car. I'll fix your car and you'll get it back in one piece, don't you worry. We'll take good care of you. I haven't seen ass like that in years. Mm. Mm -mm. What's up, girl? Yeah, you're looking fine. Oh, 
Oh, how you going? You are Mr. Graham Thompson? Yeah. Yeah? Well, we've had a bit of trouble with this guy. Does this belong to you, by any chance? Oh, yeah, that's our cat man. That's your cat man? Yeah. Yeah? Well, yeah, let me so... tell you about your cat man. Your cat allegedly started one of the biggest fights down at Toe Hotel last night. He took out six blokes, he did, and the security guards. That's right. We have three people in hospital because of him, right? He was on a piss real bad. This is the third time we have to bring him back. One more time, right? And we're going to take him to the judicial court. He's going to get locked up for good. Yeah, that's our cat. Mate. Yeah. All right. Put him down. Thanks, mate. Put a peg on it. And you, behave. See you later. Does your cat have alcohol and violence issues? Call the cat team now at Cataholics Anonymous. Hello. Oh, hello. I used to be a sumo wrestler, but no more sumo wrestler because my butt cheek is too tight. It's too tight. It's too tight. It's too, too tight. tight. Ooh, you like a top butt cheek? I love you. You love me. Uh. What the fuck did I end up? Man, my car went so hard, man. I must have ended up in Dandenong or something. Hey, why is it daytime though, Dre? Anyway, I'll find someone to fix my car. It's a fine morning to be trolling through all the horses through the Sherbrooke Forest, gentlemen! Indeed. Yes! Ah. Yes! What is that thing over there? It makes such a odd noise. Cease, cease, cease. Stand down, man. What is this monstrosity over there? Some sort of sorcery? It says Commodore on it. Some kind of carriage. He must be a Commodore! Seize him! Seize? What the f are you talking about, Dre? Is this the head gasket? Who the f are you guys, Dre? Hey! Who the f are you, Dre? What's going on with the story, mate? I am the one that sells, Dre! And some single spinners! <laughs> strange phenomenal happened last night in Broadmeadows where there was three UFOs spotted in the sky. One man came forward to tell us what he saw. His name is Sam. How are you going Sam? Can you explain to us what you saw in the sky last night? Amazing. I swear this thing was flying mate. It was like a nightclub. It had lights everywhere. I wanted to go in there and see what kind of chicks were in there, you know what I mean? Because I'm sick of the chicks on earth, mate. All they do is hound you all day. Hey, where's this? Where's that? When you coming home? What are you talking to her for? So like, why not, mate? I'm going in and see what's going on. I felt a bit left out if you ask me the truth, you know what I mean? Oh, how are you? I'm Professor Faxine. Eat true Hollywood stories when he goes into the world of Arnold Schwarzenegger's new bang blockbuster movie, The Germinator. We have Arnold Schwarzenegger around to tell us all about him. Arnold!
Hello, E. How are you? I'm here today to talk to you about my new movie. <laughs> I'm the Annie. And if you like my movies, come see my new movie. It's where I play a hippie and I have to go around and plant the trees because the people didn't need to hear. And there's a twist to the movie. I find out all the trees, they are clones. <laughs> so if you like clones and hippies and the ear, come see my new movie, The Germinator. And there's another twist to the movie. I find out I'm a clone. Here, watch a clip from my new movie. I like you today. I want to spend days with you. Weekdays, weekends, holidays. I want to be with you till the end of time. What was that? Who are you? I'm you. How could you be me? Daddy, can I ask you a question? Well, sure you can, son. Go ahead. Daddy, would I be able to see mommy again? Son, when everybody dies, they go to a place special. Like Disneyland? <laughs> yeah, sure, why not, son? It's so hard to lie to him, it's so adorable. Hey, how you doing? It's not often that you gotta lie to your son, but by the time he grows old enough and works out what's going on, you would have moved up to Kentucky! I'm your punk metal chef host, Steve. Now, let me teach you how to cook a special steak of mine. Now, I made this steak last time back in the 70s, right? And the last person who survived eating this steak was Neil from The Young Ones. As a matter of fact, I made him the way he is today. Anyway, first you gotta grab yourself a steak. Now, we're going to make sure it's hot. Let's get in there and just slap it on there, you know what I mean? And then just leave it on there for a while. Pour that over the top there. Just right over it, you know what I mean? And, and some for the master there too. Here's something that you don't want to tell anybody about. It's a secret recipe, right? This is the one that changed meal forever. Grab some heroin and just sprinkle it on top there, you know right? Powered cocaine. There you go. Don't, don't be shy on that too, just slap it on there. And a bit for the governor too, eh? Have some on that. Oh. Now, what you want to do is course it. Course it. Just spin it over and course it, you know what I mean? Coming this summer, you've been waiting a long time for an action comedy, and here it is, Robert De Niro. Yo. <laughs> You're good, Joe. Yo. Yo. Yo good, yo good, yo hey, shut the fuck up, yo yo good. Yeah. Al Pacino, I'm Al Pacino. Oh, I like everything you got. Go on, Will. Oh. Jack Nicholson. I worked with him in my last movie. He was great. He had such good work. When I read his script, it just jumped right off the page. I want to do his part. I'm just in downtown. The Mitchell Murray, and he just told me, oh, you fucked up, oh, you fucked up big time, you did, you fucked up big time, now bubble up to you. So Mr. Stallone. No reason at all, Vince Vaughn. We had to throw out that last bomb, man. Let's go get a hose from that guy's house again. Yeah, for sure, yeah, man. Yeah, sick. Oh, you little bastard stealing me bloody hose. Bastards, I know what you're getting up to. Sorry? I know what you're doing. What are you talking about? I know what you're getting up to at night time. You come in here and steal me fucking hose. <laughs> 
<laughs> you don't know what you're talking about, man. Oh, mate, that, I mate. see ya. I see you and your mates. You steal me hose and you put it in your bong and you smoke it and now you're back for more, aren't ya? No, mate, got it all wrong. Nah, you're the one that's got it all wrong, mate. You better come here before I bust your knuckles hey, off. Hey, you fucking don't have a heart attack. Hey, you, have you ever picked up your teeth with broken fingers? No, nah, I have an old fella. Yeah, well, you come over here and I'll bust you. Yeah, I'll have knock you. teeth left anyway. <laughs> Oi, don't talk to me, don't give me no disrespect, you little bastards. I know you're taking me fucking hose, alright? You don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, I do know what I'm talking about, mate. I'm old enough and bloody fucking me, you're old man, you little bastards. I was fighting three feet ninjas back in that. <laughs> Check this Get my out. oxygen, mate! <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's alright. <laughs> Enjoy! <laughs> Suck it, mate. Almost had him. <laughs> Hey fellas, what are you up to this afternoon? Oh, not much, mate. Just gonna go out and hit the piss. So I'm about to do it in about 25 minutes while the boss is back. He's not gonna know the difference. <laughs> I'm gonna hit it up hard, mate. I'm gonna slap in the back of the uni. You come check this out. Oh, fuck, I don't know, mate. Oh, the boss looks like he's coming over. Oh, no, nah, don't worry about it. She's sweet, mate. We'll be all good, eh? <laughs> well, I reckon we we'll to punish pals in about 25 minutes, mate, after lunch. Oh, no one's watching? No, 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 we're good, mate. Yeah, oh, oh, there's something to show you. There's something else coming around here. Oh, uh, well, we're getting paid to stand around all that. This is awesome. Oh, 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 oh boss is coming, boss is coming. Uh, uh, no, she's sweet, mate. We're, we're, we're working around. Nah, don't worry, guys. It's a false alarm. So what? We're all going to the pub or what? Oh, yeah, no, nah, that'd be all good, eh? I mean, fucking beats standing around here all day, doesn't it? The maker of DMC Gums Rod Claw. That's right. Your buddy right rod next rod to your bed telling you when to wake up and go to work. Rod hey, wake up and have a couple of bones before you go to work to relax you a bit, eh, mate? And it'll also tell you when it's time for smoke. Not only that, it'll also tell you when it's early knock-off. A movie with him? Eh? No, I'm not gonna do a movie with him. Why? Are you Shrieks on? Are you Shrieks on? Are you Shrieks on? Are you Shrieks on? <laughs> Fucking long board! Yeah! Hi, love. My name's Trace. As a mother, I know that my child needs his sustenance before he goes yeah, out and plays. It's just as simple, simple as that, Josh. Fucking right? Bullshit. You're not going out with Nick and all those other boys, I know what you get up to. All right, you're not going out until you have your cornflakes. Right? Fuck anyway, you, what mom. was I saying? Don't take that time with me, son. Sure, I'm going to play. It's bullshit. That's what I reckon. Fuck, shit. There's not even any milk in there. You made me use water. I know there's no milk left, love. Just use water. Right, mum had to go to the pokies last night to go meet her new boyfriend, Ross. Okay? Could be your new father. Alright? Doesn't matter if I eat my cornflakes, you're not gonna let me go out anyway. <sighs> Shit. Well, since his father left, it's been hard, you know what I mean? He um, really hasn't been himself. He finds it hard to concentrate, so I tried to be the other figure for him and uh, always going out trying to find a bloke for him, not for me. Because I'm fine, I've got my own job. Well, I work as a dispatch officer for Siva Logistics down on Miller's Road. He's got his head stuck into those video games too much and not in his books. Daryl here again from Jeff's Shed. We've got cats, glass, ceramic, plastic, real cats even. We've got so much cat regalia and cat life under this roof, we couldn't even fit it under one roof. And this roof can fit three WGT 74T75T22 frigates. Three WGT 75 t 22 frigates. We've got every type of cat you can think of. Tabby, Molly, Collie. Black, white, Egyptian water cats even. We've got cats from different parts of the world. 60, 70, 80, 110 percent off. We've got so many cats here. If you don't come and get them by 12 o'clock, we're just going to let them out the back door. See you later. Now, if you want a cat, come and adopt one. Be a good guy. Hey, that's what we're here for. Good guys. We also sell Siamese cats. We are Siamese cats. First time at Jeff's shed ever. The Venomous Cougar, that's right, the Venomous, venomous Cougar. cougar. Wow, wow, wow. Venomous, venomous Cougar. Don't mouth off at me, you little 
Mean elf are gonna f ya. We're gonna bust your damn little dungeon and show you to listen. <laughs> Yo, yeah, it's my youth now. <laughs> Coming up next on Mainstream TV, it's the news Operation Repo, then followed by Miami Toe, Ice Road Truckers, Hardcore Porn, American Pickets, CSI, then CSI Miami, then followed by CSI Cold Case, then followed by Law and Order, Law and Order SVU, Big Brother, Big Brother up late. Then up late with hot dogs from Big Brother. Then at 7 a.m. the news with hot dogs. How you doing? I'm Martin Hanna, actor, director, writer, producer of ADH TV. Over the last three years, I've provided you with some clean comedy, some real dirty comedy, and some that just really shouldn't have ever made the cut. Next year, ADH TV will be back, but under a different format and with a totally new crew. We're actually going to write the show this time get some proper props, and make it something that's going to take it to the next level. I hope you enjoyed watching me over the last three years, and all the volunteers who sweated blood and tears to make this show happen. Thank you very much. So take the photographs and still friends in your mind. Hanging on a shelf in good health and good time Tattoos of memories and they asking on trial For what it's worth, it was worth all the while It's something unpredictable But in the end it's right Sit, Staffy, sit! Bad boy. I made this. Dick. Dorsal. Pin.